For the first time since 2005, the Saints have a new head coach. Dennis Allen moving over from defensive coordinator to head coach after Sean Payton stepped down. His defense has been great the past two seasons, and he has an even better chance to succeed his second time around as a head coach. Allen, 8-28 in two seasons as Raiders head coach, but that was a decade ago. He's been the Saints DC since 2016. Here's more from our Pete Prisco with Dennis Allen. All right, I come off the practice field, and you, uh, you got into him a little bit today for fighting. Yeah, look, I mean, you know, it's, I, I love the fact that our guys are, are competing and they're practicing extremely hard. Um, you know, you just got to know where that line is and, and understand that you always want to play up to that line, but you never can cross it and hurt your team. And kind of gotten to a point where I thought we were a little more interested in some of the other stuff rather than getting better at football. So I just reminded them that there's ways that I can encourage them to, uh, to focus more on the football. You know, if they want to, you know, condition themselves to be boxers, then we'll, we'll, we'll run gassers and make sure they're in great condition. <laughs> I asked a lot of guys who get a second chance to be a head coach, what did you learn from the first time that you're going to apply to this? I think the biggest thing, you know, is just really just be me and do it the way that I want it to be done. Uh, and have confidence in myself and being able to do that. Um, I think being here and being in the situation that I'm, that I'm in uh, with the familiarity that I have with the organization, what they have with me, um, certainly I'm a lot more comfortable in that environment. The second part of that is you've been with the defensive guys. How are you acclimating yourself to the offensive guys? Yeah, I'm just trying to spend as much time as I can kind of evaluating the whole team um, and, and, and being around you know, I spent a lot of time, you know, visiting with the Pete Carmichael offensive coaches, a lot of time with Darren Rizzi, special teams. I feel great about where we're at defensively in terms of the staff that we have in there uh, that's that's able to handle it when I'm not able to be in the room. So uh, I've just tried to be a little bit more involved, um, more so just from an understanding uh, of what we're doing. Um, you know, in the special teams or, or on or on offense. Do you get a little thrill though when the defense gets the better of the offense still, or you you find yourself Listen, caught the, in that? That's the interesting thing about being the head coach. You know, you're you're pissed off every day at practice, and you're happy every day at practice because <laughs> somebody won and somebody <laughs> lost. You know, and I can pick and choose which one I want to be on that particular day. So, um, and, and the good thing is for us in this camp, I feel like. You know, there, there's been some days where I felt like the offense really excelled, and then there's been some days where the defense has. One last thing, uh, Jameis Winston at quarterback, what have you seen from him in this camp? Um, yeah, I, I think he's confident in what we're doing. Um, I think he feels good about what we're, what we're trying to accomplish offensively. I, you know, it's really kind of the third year for him being back in this system. Uh, so you, you can feel that familiarity that he has with the system. Um, you know, certainly coming off the injury, and then he had a little bit of a foot. Um, earlier in camp that he's he missed some time with but i feel good about where he's at thanks man appreciate yeah, it awesome thanks do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game the highlights the picks the instant analysis no yelling no fake debates no politics hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment